what's going on everybody it's once again Arduino dude here so in today's tutorial we are learning about a DHT22 sensor to measure temperature and humidity of our room so let's get started so firstly we included the liquid crystal library which is necessary for the LCD monitor then we defined the pins we have connected our LCD to the Arduino then we included the DHT library, which you can find from tools to manage libraries. Now search for DHT. You need to install this library, which is DHT sensor library. I have already installed, so I don't need. Now close the window. Then we defined our DHT pin to be 9 because we attached our DHT pin to digital pin 9 of our Arduino then there are two types of DHT sensors one is DHT 11 and another one is DHT 22 so to, in today's tutorial we're using DHT 22 so then we named our DHT sensor to be DHT and we took two parameters which is DHT pin and DHT tab which we have previously defined then in the voice setup, we started the communication between the LCD and the Arduino. Then started the communication between the sensor and Arduino. Then in while loop, we gave our system two seconds to settle down. So in the first row of our LCD monitor, we printed temperature and then the value of our temperature, which I'm going to show you later. The code is downwards. Then in the second row of the LCD, we wrote humidity and the value of humidity. Then, here is the magic. So from here to the end of this code, this is all about computing the Celsius and the humidity. And I have also given the code for Fahrenheit, Kelvin, and the heat index. You can use that as well. But in today's tutorial, we are only learning about temperature and humidity. So once you are done with this, just like before, Go to tools, select your board, which is Arduino Uno. Then again, go to tools, select the board, then hit upload. I'm using here dry to increase the temperature of my DH22 sensor so that I can show you the demonstration, how the temperature is going up and being displayed on the LCD monitor. So as you can see, as I hold the hairdryer in front of the sensor, the temperature is going up and now it went up to 51 degrees and is being displayed on the LCD monitor. So hope you found the video useful. See you in the next tutorial.